Assalamu alaikum everyone, your boy Abu Bakr from Turtles Horizon and I'm back with a Suna video today. You know I love my Sunas. So today we're talking about a few activities that Prophet Muhammad used to do. Number one is archery. Archery is very, very cool looking and very fun to do. I used to do it when I was a kid. I recommend doing it. There's obviously a lot of classes out there. I think they range from like 100 or like 50 bucks. So I definitely recommend it for like you know, a lot of young people, maybe some older people as well, if you guys are really into that. You do get blessings while doing archery. Prophet Muhammad used to love doing archery. I recommend that. Number two is swimming. Swimming is a sunnah, actually. Prophet Muhammad used to love swimming. And it's actually a full body workout. So it works your full body and you get blessings. Wallahi, I wanted to keep doing that. I actually swam uh, two weekends ago. It's, it's fun. I, I miss it. I, I got out of the, the swimming pool and my whole body was hurting. It's fun, though. I loved it. Number three is horseback riding. Horseback riding is uh, one of Prophet Muhammad's favorite things to do. And it's a very well, like, oriented, like, thing to do. It's, like, it's really good for your, like, your core. Because you have to, like, crouch down, and, like, while you're riding. I used to do it when I was a kid back in summer school. And it's so, it, like, gives you so much energy. And it, it's fun. It's fun. So it's also a blessing as well. I recommend it. There's probably is a few classes out there that, you know, give you horseback riding lessons. I'd love to try those. Uh, number four is camel racing as you know my name means father of young camel of a walker and i love camels and there's actually a thing down i think in saudi and some other of the little middle eastern countries um is a lot of camel racing prophet muhammad used to love camel racing that is really interesting actually because i never knew there was actually racing until i was watching a video actually Tonight, I was watching a video about uh, the Bedouin tribes up in the desert that would have camel races, and that is cool. And you get sunas, like uh, suna, like blessings for it? Why not, dude? I, I would love to, you know, ride a camel. That's my goal. Before I die, wallahi, I want to ride a camel. Number four? No. Number five. Number five, I think it's number five. That is... Wrestling. Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam used to be the five-year reigning champion in Medina for wrestling. And that is cool. So when you do wrestling, like let's say BJJ, so Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu, or just wrestling in general, like that, though you get blessings for doing that. And you are training yourself to protect your family and your friends. You know what I mean? And it's all the Gary. It's a farb. For all Muslims to learn how to fight, how to protect yourself, how to protect your family. So that's another thing we need to do. So these are the cool sunnahs that you can actually do regularly for, I guess, an adjustment. I think you could ride your bike. That's a sunnah. And just staying active. Just staying active in general, like going jogging or working out. Or even just riding your bike, it is sunnah because you are staying active and you're actually supposed to be active. It is actually a sin to have a dad bod, to have a big belly. There's a hadith, um, no a hadith actually, it's uh, from Omar, may Allah be pleased with him, that states he saw a man with a big belly, and he went up to the man and, said, <laughs> and he said, um, what is that? And the man replied to Omar, may Allah be pleased with him, oh, it's a blessing from Allah. And he's like, no, that's a curse from Allah. I'm just saying, bro, if I get blessings for just working out and being healthy, us. I'm going to do it. I love it. You know what I mean? So please push the sunnah. Please like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. I love you guys. Assalamu alaikum.